and free stop the contest against Arboleda. Now with Beckford. Performance against Amari Jones really, really got people saying, who is this Mexican? Three is Emil Jovan Aliyev from Azerbaijan. Judges from Germany, Philippines, Algeria, Russia, and Norway. Just the three rounds, two tall men, equally matched, weight, reach, height. Who's the better boxer? Who's going to take it into the final? Mexico in blue, Pittsburgh, round. Panama in the red. Fast enterprising, first 30 seconds. Have we really taken the initiative? Both men trying to take the initiative. <laughs> Getting down low, needing to at the moment, and then first clinch. And so little to choose between them. Well matched. Side of the glove. And that's the call. Sometimes boxers can be too similar in style. Because, uh, to neutralize each other out well, that was the case until about 10 seconds ago now we're beginning to get some tagging coming from Verde Very tough one to call, very little to choose between them. I'm not sure Beckford's uh, been able to land that much on Verde. And Verde is beginning to get some points on the board here. That was all arm, but taking the initiative. Judges, do your thing. Initiative coming from Verde. Although Beckford going in there, he's, he's caught him a couple of times with that right. That might be enough to be persuasive. No, it's uh, the aggression of Marco Verde. Not that Beckford's been passive, he's just not been able to land much. That highlight that we saw, one of the few occasions he was able just to tag his opponent. Second round underway, Verde, all five judges in his corner at the moment. This is his semi-final to lose. 
Beckford in the red for Panama has got to take it away from him. Trying to do that in the early stages. But a good evasive work from the Mexican. Tanki of Canada and Jose Rodriguez of Ecuador awaiting in the uh, other semi-final which will immediately follow this bout oh, comes thick and fast it's uh, tomorrow so not an awful lot of time to recover Beckford holding on an awful lot and I'm not really understanding what he's trying to achieve here maybe fearing, fearing Verde because Verde has got a knockout punch in 15 professional wins he's got a knockout on six occasions one year is old uh, in Sinaloa and your reputation to see it again Five seconds in the second. Beckford needed this one to be a big round. He was behind on all five judges. Macho Beckford in the red for Panama. He's had a big enough round. Oh, I am sure he's not had a big enough round. Definitely now. He will take a standing count. Verdi is now utterly in control of this contest. Final 10 seconds, Beckford. Horrible feeling when you know you're down, when you know you're struggling. Verde, little nods of approval to his seconds. significant moment coming up it's the left coming through as the gloves were down the right caught him by surprise and the right glove stayed down and Beckford was tagged standing count for him not a significant lead now significant all five judges and Marco Verde Sure, he won't just stay out of trouble. He'll keep on taking the, the bout to Beckford. He's shown good agility for. Doesn't look the most agile, but nice and light on his toes, light on his feet. Good eight. Come under the radar and uh, is deserving his place in the final four. This performance so far deserves a place in the final. Performance against Amari Jones yesterday really got everybody standing up and taking notice of this fella. Getting through to the final guarantees your place at the Olympic Games in Paris next summer. 
Oxford and Panama would have loved that to have been the prize. There are other ways for him to qualify. Oh, that's a solid leg. In the early stages, this looked at a very even contest, a very even matchup. But as the battle has gone on, Ferde has taken control. Second part of the first round, his uh, dominance came through. Completely lost the second round. That ended with a standing count on here. Taking his chances, picking his moments. Snapping the head back of Beckford. <laughs> Beckford now flinching under the onslaught from Marco Verde. Good boxer, light on his feet, good build, aggressive, got a big punch, also got the variety to go low, go high, can defend, and got just about everything, Marco Verdi. And he's also 100% sure, I think, has got the decision and the place in the final. Good job, well done by the young fella from Sinaloa. Sinaloa has a man to be proud of there. Adolfo Beckford has made Panama proud, but his run will end at the semi-final stage. A good run, though it was. Decision is in. The winner was bought by unanimous decision, advancing to the men's 71 kilogram gold medal final. In the blue corner, Mexico's Mark. Photos for posterity. And they'll be hoping it's a gold medal photo tomorrow for Marco Alonso Verde Alvarez. Winner by unanimous points. All three rounds from all five judges. It was even for around about 90 seconds, and then he really got into his groove. Good left. Good performance. Guaranteed at least a silver medal and also a place at the Olympic Games in Paris. Well, the judge is scoring a Beckford way down. The Russian judge, 25. Uh, an eight in there from him and from the German judge in the second round. Obviously, that was for the, the count, the automatic count. 